Well, in all stop. seriousness, isn't it time to put a roof on fence? Would you? You got to, you know, you got to find, you're right. You got to find your angle, what what works best. She had the, same, she had the same angle. Hey, what's your good side? I don't know. Is it this one? <laughs> no. No. <Nope. laughs> to be determined. Hey, you're going to give to photography since his 2010 retirement from Major League Baseball. It's always been his passion dating back to when he was a photojournalism major at USC back in the 80s. Earlier this month, he opened his first solo photography exhibit at Fenimore Art Museum in Cooperstown, New York. Here's more on that. Let the first two games of the series rob a homer, hit a homer. What more can you ask for from Aaron Judge? Neither Nestor Cortez nor Patrick Sandoval has lost a game all season long, so something's got to give. The deciding game from the Bronx at 4 this afternoon. The Cubs have a better record than the Dodgers three weeks in. It's early, of course, but Chicago has been so much fun to watch. Cody Bellinger at the top of that list, hitting 378 over his last nine games. He will face his old team on the north side at 740 tonight, come to think of it. Even the Padres are chasing the Diamondbacks in the West. Michael Waka getting the start for the visiting team on the day. Fernando Tatis Jr. rejoins the team in the minors, hitting 515 with seven homers in eight games. What? It's at 940 tonight. With more on Tatis's return, here's MLB.com Padres beat reporter Garrett Cole. What about Dylan Cease? Uh, and what about Shohei Otani? Come on, come on. I mean, we, I'm, I'm a bird. What's Baltimore? You want some home fries with that? Okay. What's New York?